Hey love, so it's your girl April and this video today is going to be for MyFirstWigs.com which is sister company to RPGShow.com. So this company here has been around actually for one year as of today. July 14th makes their one year anniversary. So what better way to celebrate with several new units as well as $15 off your purchase and double rewards points. So yes you girls, if you are interested, this unit is going to be the one that I'm going to be showing you. It's called the April unit and I will post all the information below but this is quality wigs for beginners you actually don't have to be a beginner to purchase anything from their websites but they do make it really simple for those who have never owned a quality wig meaning a something better than synthetic and they make it super easy so I'm going to show you what comes with my first wigs purchases now first of all you will get the wig which I've already went ahead and styled and this one is 20 inches and it's a natural color like a 1B natural color and it is basically one of their full lace glueless wigs which you can par just about anywhere so I'll show you that in a second but the first thing that I want to show you is you do get this box which is really sturdy so if you want to keep your unit in it then you can go ahead and do so inside the box you will have your um, spec tab or just informational paper that says the length the hair texture the lace color the cap size the wig color the cap construction um, this one here is the Malaysian human hair straight wig with side bangs and it is a natural hair color in 20 inches silky which is non yakky light brown lace color cap size number one wig color brown um, which is the cap and the glueless lace cap which I absolutely I love the glueless lace caps. So your wigs do come in one of these bags right here, which more or less look like the dry cleaner bags that you put your clothing in. It does have a zipper, so this is like a really good way to store your wigs. Really pretty and bright color. It also comes with one of these, which are the wig stands. So instead of you having to toss your wig, you can always put it on the wig stand. And this is really easy to put together. All you do is just kind of like slide them in the slot. Put this ring on the top and place your wig on top of it and she is ready to be rested until the next day. You'll also get my first wig carrying pouch. Now this is great to carry like makeup in or if you want to carry it as a clutch just turn it around the opposite way and you can carry it like so. But in this comes new or things that beginners would need. Now a lot of people like to use elastic or the elastic band on their lace wig um, which gives you like a tighter fit. So if the combs aren't tight enough you can always put this in it and it will make your wig stay like in place. All you would need to do is go ahead and put it from here to here the temple and make sure that you stretch it. You don't want to just put it here. You want to pull it as taut because that's how it's going to hold tightly to your um, your head but there are loads of tutorials on YouTube of how you can achieve this method but they've also included that a wig cap so you can protect your hair underneath one of my favorite combs because I love these rat tail combs which have the metal pieces at the end these are really good for parting your hair of course instructions and how to take care of your hair and well as well as how to make it look natural and who is that there? Hmm. How to attach or wear the wig. Seems like I'm right here in this, inside the brochure. But yes, and it also tells you how to put together, assemble the actual um, wig stand. So yes, look at that. Here I go again. So excited. Okay. And also in here you will get a card of bobby pins, which is helpful in case you want to hold your hair. Right. Two clips in the kit to hold your hair back in place now let's get on to this actual unit so the hair is 20 inches and it is a glueless full lace wig there are combs in the front area which are placed on each temple a comb in the back along with the adjustable strap i went ahead and styled this baby prior because i wanted to give it some more volume but i also do have like a swoop get, swoop bang going on so let's style her and see how she works out Prior to me doing the video, I already placed some lighter color concealer on it. I didn't really tweeze anything, so we're just going to try it out as it is.
okay guys so here we go with the unit so really easy to do I didn't have to do much to the bang area because it's just a swoop bang you can always change the parting if you want you probably can put it in the, as a regular bang but keep in mind you will need to cut it if you want to do it as a middle bang unless you want the hair all over your eyes but really easy to put on I really didn't have to do much like I said I didn't um, tweeze any of the lace so it is a part there and the side bang the swoopage worked out perfectly well although I did forget to use my concealer which I'm going to do that right now okay so hopefully you guys can see that now I did use a little bit of my strand maximizer which just makes your edges look thicker I've already used it prior to this video so I really didn't need to use much of it but for the most part this is like a really great wig for beginners because it's simple you don't have to do much you can do the techniques like other youtubers or people that wear lace wigs with the elastic band method or you can bobby pin it or you can just bring the straps in really tight because I have the straps in really tight I don't need the elastic band I really don't do the elastic band that often um, I used to but I don't now especially when it was just like a regular full lace and when it's a glueless full lace it's not really necessary especially if you can and adjust the straps and situate the combs so it did fit snug I do have the straps really tight because my hair is thin so I don't have like a lot of hair to make the wig cap bulky or the full to fill it up so I do need the straps uh, a little bit thinner or tighter rather um, the hair density is average for me I like a lot of hair so for those of you who just start out in wigs it's always beneficial to start out slowly and gradually build your way up but my first wig this is their first year anniversary so happy anniversary to them and like I said you can take $15 off of your purchase and you also get double reward points as well there are a lot of amenities that come with the box so keep that in mind as well and make sure you follow them on their social media platforms which I will also post below as well as there will be new units coming out and also you can also check out their sister wig site which is rpgshow.com which has been around for actually nine years you guys so nine years is a long time and I congratulate them on my first wigs for big beginners because it's marked a year and what better way to celebrate is getting a discount and getting some new wigs on the website so congratulations and happy anniversary so on that note let me know what you think of this unit right here which is the April unit and as always stay diva and divalicious make sure you rate comment subscribe and thumbs this video up if you liked and enjoyed it and I'll see you girls and guys on my next video